They call her the blind visionary because even though she's blind, she's had the vision to transform so many lives. Virginia Jacko lost her sight when she was in her 40s, but even though her world went dark, Virginia saw the light and found her purpose. Today, Virginia is the CEO of Miami Lighthouse for the Blind. Good morning. Good morning, Olga. Thank you so much for being here, Virginia. Thank you. Thank First, you. before we talk about your amazing story, who is this precious dog? This is my guide dog, Eva. She's my eyes. She's from Guiding Eyes for the Blind, and she's with me all the time. She's really amazing. Good Beautiful. Girl. Good girl. Virginia, let's talk about your blindness. What happened? I slowly developed an eye disease where you lose your eyesight from the outside in. I say it's kind of like the hole in a donut. It gets smaller, smaller, smaller. So you noticed it. But I didn't notice it right away. Oh, okay. And then I couldn't start to see people on this side or that side. But when I went to the eye doctor, I was told I will become totally blind. And what did you do after that? You know, there was no time for tears. I was told by my mother, you need to turn this into something and help the blind. So I know you left a pretty big position in Purdue University. You moved to Miami and you become a client for Miami Lighthouse for the Blind, right? Right. And a few years later after that, you do the most amazing thing. You become the first CEO. That's that is amazing. totally blind. That is totally right? blind for Miami Lighthouse for the Blind. Uh -huh. How did that feel at that moment? It was a challenge, but I knew I could do it. And you did, because I know the numbers have been amazing of what you've done. I believe you started with 500 people that went there to now 16,000? Yes, during the time period I was CEO, the growth was about 34 times, from 500 to 16,000 each year. We went to Miami Lighthouse for the Blind and witnessed all the good Virginia has done and how much everyone loves her. Take a look at this. Good morning, everybody. We should all mean as much to as many people as Virginia does. She's just been such a difference to so many people. You look at this, not just the physical growth, but what's happened in terms of the advancement of services here, of, of how, how many different ways this agency touches people's lives. And that's all Virginia. Wheels on the bus go round and round all through the town. Virginia is an inspiration. She's someone to be admired and, and a true leader. Without her, this place would not be what it is today. I mean, she has just um, brought so much growth to Miami Lighthouse that it's, it's incredible. And I've seen that growth and I witnessed it firsthand and it's, it's truly amazing. You love being here, don't you? It's my passion. Why? Why? When I called my mother and said, Mom, I got my eye diagnosis. I'm gonna go totally blind. My mother said, I'm going to pray then that you do big things for the blind. I said, Mom, I don't even know any blind people. She said, you will and you'll help them. There is a child that is blind in our pre-kindergarten that's getting an early start, that will be mainstreamed, and in the future down the road might just be one of the next blind and president CEOs in this country and it might just be at the Miami Lighthouse for the Blind. It was really great to be there to see what everyone says about you and the work you've done. It's about blind babies. It's about the teenagers. It's about helping the blind get a job. And it's also about efficient use of the dollars people provide Miami Lighthouse. And that is why the National Evaluator, Charity Navigator, they evaluate each year about 9,000 nonprofits. We are among the top 1%. In fact, the top 39 out of 9,000. Your passion is amazing, and I know the job is still not over, right? So there much, is much more, to, more do. to be done. Yes, there is. How can anyone out there help Miami Lighthouse for the Blind and help the organization? Of course, we always need donor support. And of course, if you know someone that is affected by vision loss, like a senior, contact Miami Lighthouse. Our website, Miami Lighthouse, all one word, dot org. I want to thank you so much for coming. Olga, and, thank you. And of course, if you'd like more information on Virginia or Miami Lighthouse for the Blind, you can also go to our website, and that's thebalancingact.com.